Fred was a Delta. That makes me a legacy. They gotta take me. It's like their law. Don't worry. I'll put in a good word for you. Great. I heard Delta's the worst house on campus. the Animal House of 1963 in a place called Faber College, which, as far as I know, doesn't exist. But the house exists. It's located in Eugene. It's the state's halfway house. Since the movie, the house has been reshingled, repainted, and the windows replaced. It took 12 takes and 12 windows to get the right shot of that mannequin being thrown out the window. For the halfway house director, Steve Bennett, it was a long two months since the halfway correction facility was in full operation during the entire filming. You said it was business as usual as they were, they were filming. I saw a scene where a cow comes wandering out the front. Uh, that must have been somewhat bizarre. Uh, well, they just went out and got a, some cow for the, for the movie from a local farm. He, uh, in the movie, they had to bring the cow into the center and, and walk it out the front stairs. And, you know, to, to be working back and forth in, in the offices and then look up and here's this cow uh, standing in the, in the foyer patiently waiting for its part in the movie. It was kind of unusual. <laughs> what about all those interior shots? The motorcycle up the stairway. And who could forget the fun-filled, action-packed toga party? All of the interiors were shot next door at the Sigma Nu fraternity. Sorry, I was trying to get into the mood as to how the Animal House really was back in 1963. This is the way the living room looks today. It belongs to the Sigma Nu fraternity. It's very neat and very pleasant, but nothing that uh, a few dozen beer bottles, some spaghetti on the walls, and some threadbare rugs couldn't overcome. Oh, uh, well, they took a belt sander to the carpet and they uh, plastered up the walls to look like cracks and uh, told us even one night when we had spaghetti to come in here and throw our spaghetti around. It's been 18 months since Animal House was completed and overtly nothing has really changed on the Oregon campus. But things have picked up a bit for the Sigma News. Membership applications are up they have gained the status of being the animal house, and so they tell me dates are a lot easier to come by. Larry Sturholm at large in Eugene, Oregon.